Pushpagiri College of Dental Science presents A glimpse into the history of dentistry A profession that is ignorant of its past experiences has lost a valuable asset because it has missed its best guide to the future 6500 years back ancient dentistry has been discovered in a 6500 year old human jawbone a lump of beeswax that appears to be the earliest evidence of dental filling 2600 years back Hesse Ray was a first known dentist and was instrumental in the advancements of dental techniques we use today dental tools in the 14th century Guy de Chauliac invented the dental pelican which resembles a pelican's beak it was used to perform dental extractions up until the late 18th century pelican was replaced by the dental key which was replaced by the modern forceps of the 20th century a dental pelican a dental key and dental forceps 1400 years back the idea of toothbrush was introduced in china the first toothbrush with bristles was invented in china and made of animal bo- bone bamboo and hog hair the bristles were very hard in 1530 in ancient greece hippocrates and aristotle wrote about dentistry specifically about treating decaying teeth but it wasn't until 1530 that the first book entirely devoted to dentistry the little medicinal book of all kinds of diseases and infirmities was teeth was published in 1723 pierre fauchard a french surgeon credited as the father of modern dentistry published his influential book the surgeon dentist a treatise on teeth for the first time defined in a comprehensive system for caring for teeth and treating teeth In 1776 the first forensic dentist in the United States was Paul Revere was known for the identification of the fallen revolutionary soldiers Dr Joseph Warren who suffered a severe head trauma during the war was identified by the small denture that Revere had fabricated for him In 1790 John Greenwood invented the first known dental foot engine he adopted his mother's foot treadle spinning wheel to rotate a drill He was responsible for designing Washington's famous dentures which were not of wood but carved from hippopotamus tusk. Joseph Flagg, a prominent American dentist in the same year, constructs the first dental chair. To a Windsor chair, he attached an adjustable headrest plus an arm extension that could hold instruments. In 1833, Edward Crocker and his nephew Moses brought amalgam to the United States in 1833. The two came to New York from England introducing a new method for using amalgams to fill the teeth of dental patients. In 1840, the Baltimore College of Dental Surgery was chartered by an act of General Assembly of Maryland. Its co-founders Drs. Horace H. Hayden and Chapin A. Harris have both been inducted in the Pierre Fauchard Academy Hall of Fame. Dr. Harris was the school's first dean and a professor of practical dentistry. In 1864, Burnham invented the rubber dam. This invention of rubber dam and the fact that he decimated it completely and selfishly earned him the highest honors from American and European dental profession. In 1866, Lucy Hobbs Taylor, an American school teacher and a dentist, known for being the first woman to graduate from dental school, she was originally denied admittance to the Eclectic Mental College in Cincinnati, Ohio, due to her gender. Due to this, a professor in the college agreed to tutor her and encourage her to practice dentistry. Tays Good Certified, or Dr. Washington Sheffield of New London, Connecticut, manufactured toothpaste in collapsible tube and called it Dr. Sheffield's Dentrifix in 1892. In 1896, Charles Edmund Kells Jr., an American dentist and inventor who is sometimes described as the father of dental radiography, He practiced dentistry in New Orleans for 50 years and held about 30 patents for dental and electrical devices. He introduced a suction apparatus for use by both dentists and surgeons. Took some of the earliest x-rays of teeth of live patients, hired the first female dental assistant and one of the, had one of the first dental offices with electricity. Wilhelm Conrad Rotgen discovered the x-rays in 1895 while prominent New Orleans dentist C. Edmund Kells takes the first dental x-ray in 1896. Dr G V Black he earned the title of the grand old man of dentistry 
He standardized the rules of cavity preparation and fillings. He developed the principle of extension for prevention. He taught in dental schools, became a dean, and wrote more than 500 articles and several books. In 1920, the first dental college was established at Calcutta in nine, by Dr. R. Ahmed. Dr. Rafuddin Ahmed was an Indian dentist, educator, and later minister in the West Bengal cabinet. He is the first president of DCI and the father of dentistry in India. In 1949, DCI, a statutory body, starts its operation from 12th April. It was formed under the Act of Parliament known as the Dentist Act 1948, financed mainly by grants from the Government of India, Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, with sources of other income as well. All India Dental Association was set up in 1949 and Dr. Rafuddin Ahmed was its first president. In 1960, Dr. Rafal Brown introduced the dental composites. The use of laser in soft tissues treatment was introduced as well. Mobile Dental Clinic The early 1960s witnessed the development of Department of Community and Social Dentistry. The first of these units were introduced in Detroit, Alabama and Kentucky. 1965, the first dental implant was fitted into the first ever human patient, Gosta Larson. 2005, the patient had passed away with the original implant still securely placed after more than 40 years. It was fitted by Per Ingvar Branimark, a Swedish physician and research professor, acknowledged as a father of modern dental implantology. We would like to conclude this presentation. Special thanks to Dr. Ben Lee George, Dr. Reno Rupak Soman, Ashik Thomas, Georgit Sajeev, Dion Paul and Thomas Philip.